There he is. <laughs> Tears of joy to see that old man. <laughs> oh, unbelievable. Look at him. <laughs> Bahamas, here we go, lovely jubilee. There she is, one of four jubilees preserved. Oh, excellent. Oh, the 67. Go West Coast Railways Plus 33s on the what's the name? I heard the name something Torbay Venturer. It will come back to me with the BR Mark II's in blue and grey. And they do look lovely. Huh. They're similar to that first one, similar to the one tornado once pulled. And the third or fourth. Lovely stock. Here we go. Can't go wrong with streamlining. <laughs> oh, that's unbelievable. BR Blue Pacific. And the class 47 is Lady Diane Spencer. Turf Hotel. Along the X Estuary. Where's Sir Nigel Gresley? The A4 named after the London North Eastern Railway's chief mechanical engineer. Where are you? It's a good thing I stopped at Starcross because if I carried on to Dawlish, I'd have missed him. So where is the old boy? Please blow your whistle. Come on. Is that a brush type 4 at the back? That's being class 47. <sighs> Gotta love the A4 chime whistle. And to think that Sir Nigel Gresley, Bitten, and Blue Peter will be sharing Flying Scotsman's auxiliary tender. But does that mean Blue Peter would have his tender converted to a corridor type? Your boy, Mallard's brother, the hundredth steam loco built by the LNER. Come on. <sighs> also, to think that Sir Nigel Gresley has flung Scotsman's corridor tender from the late 20s into the early 30s. <laughs> what 
a beautiful A4. Galway Princess, a lovely brush type form. Absolutely lovely.